But you've got a job too. You've got to show up to school on time. You've got to pay attention in your class. You've got to do your homework. You've got to study for exams. You've got to stay out of trouble. You've got to instill a sense of excellence in everything that you do. That kind of discipline, that kind of drive, that kind of hard work is absolutely essential for success. And I, I, I can speak from experience here because uh, unlike Kelly, I can't say I always had this discipline. See, I can tell she was always disciplined. I, I wasn't always disciplined. I wasn't always the best student when I was younger. I made my share of mistakes. I, I still remember a conversation I had with my mother in high school. I was kind of a goof off. And I was about the age of, of, of some of, the, some of the, the folks here. And my grades were slipping. I hadn't started my college applications. I was acting, as my mother put it, sort of casual about my future. I was doing good enough. You know, I, I, was, I was smart enough that I could kind of get by. But I wasn't really applying myself. And, and so uh, I suspect there's a conversation that'll sound familiar to some students and some parents here today. She decided to sit me down and said I had to change my attitude. My attitude was what I imagine every teenager's attitude is when your parents have a conversation with you like that. I was like, you know, I, I don't need to hear all this. I'm doing okay. I'm not flunking out. So I started to say that, and she just cut me right off. She said, you can't just sit around waiting for luck to see you through. She said, you can get into any school you want in the country if you just put in a little bit of effort. We can have the most dedicated teachers, the most supportive parents, the best schools in the world, and none of it will make a difference. None of it will matter unless all of you fulfill your responsibilities. Unless you show up to those schools, unless you pay attention to those teachers, unless you listen to your parents and grandparents and other adults and put in the hard work it takes to succeed.